Well, at least you ain't run off. What are you talking about? Pearson left. <laughs> Old uncle. The traitors. Both gone. Both gone at dawn. They said to young Tilly they were running to save themselves. <laughs> I think Mary Beth left as well. So it goes? They're goddamn cowards, Arthur. Cowards! Of all the time we spent to run off! Well, I guess they don't want to die, Dutch. Ain't nobody gonna... <coughs> this is a tough time. And you ain't, you ain't doing too well. But we, our community, we will survive. They will not crush us. I hope so, but if we let Jack and the woman free, well, maybe we can. There ain't no freedom for no one in this country no more, Arthur. One more big score, we got enough money to leave. All this turmoil has the army and the Pinkerton spinning. We take a boat and slip away. I don't know what you're saying, Dutch, but I heard it all before too many times. Just one more There's train. always a goddamn train. Arthur, this is different. We know this is full of cash, army payroll, money and supplies to repair the bridge that you blew. This is all going to plan. We rob Uncle Sam and we leave. <laughs> the poetry of it all. What do you think? Sounds wonderful. Hell, I ain't got much to lose, but you know the woman and their children and John and his family? I'm afraid I have to insist because the Pinkertons come, come again. They will kill everyone. John? Insist? Yeah, insist. Of course, pal. Whatever you think is best, I will. See to it. Now, we're gonna rob a train? Sure. We will survive. We will flourish. Come on. We have work to do, my friends. Let's go. We're gonna borrow a little money from old Uncle Sam and be out of his hair once and for all. He insists upon it. Insists. Let's ride out, gentlemen! <laughs>